Mel Gibson's ex-wife was afraid of him. I'd like for people to know the real Mel Gibson, even though he's rich and famous, but he's a bully and I'm standing up for the bully. Mel Gibson scared Oksana and their infant daughter to death. That night when he beat us up, and if it was if it was two centimeters to the left or to the right whilst I was holding the baby in my arms, she could have been dead now. Mel's actions shocked even his friends. I couldn't believe it. You know what I mean? I just mm -hmm. could not believe mm -hmm. that that was Mel Gibson. Is Mel Gibson truly living up to his Mad Max character? It's just something that you can't switch it off. I mean, you get sick of it, but you can't switch it. Mel met Oksana shortly after his first wife filed for divorce. They started dating within a month, and soon after, they had a baby girl. The couple seemed in love until Oksana made a scary statement. She accused Gibson of domestic assault. He was shaking, he was, his fists were clenching, he was breathing like a, an, an animal, he was marching around like a raged bull frothing at the mouth. That's the face I've seen quite a few times before that, but it never went in such rage like on January 6th. That was the worst. So what horrible thing happened on January 6th? Mel was screaming and yelling and spitting in my face till it was covered in saliva and he kept screaming in baby's ears just because I kept asking him, stop, you're gonna hurt her, you're gonna hurt her. He kept screaming <sighs> like a crazy man. Oksana told everyone the frightening details. He pulls a gun out, basically, and he says, if I leave, then he's going to um, blow his brains out on the wall. A lot of people didn't want to believe Oksana. They thought the girl was just after the star actor's millions of dollars because his first wife sued him for half his estate. What's happening to Mel right now? I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know. But then someone revealed Oksana and Mel's phone records. A lot of people looked at Gibson in a new light. You need medication. I need a woman! I don't need medication. You need a f***ing bat in my side of the head. How about that? Mel always kept his personal life a secret. He was afraid of publicity. But I mean, I've had people coming over the fence with cameras and listening devices and all kinds of crap like that. So, I mean, you know, I always had my phone bugged once. I mean, it's, it's bizarre. Yeah, somebody just wants to know what you're up to. But this time, he didn't manage to keep the scandal a secret. Mel's career was going downhill. So that's why I'm so angry, because I don't have any friends. The career is over. No one was ready to defend Mel's actions. Have you heard the tapes? Have you listened to them? What he says? Is that not violence? There is no winner in this story. Oksana has suffered no less than Mel. He needs to grow up and he needs to be a father and he needs to lose his huge ego and start taking responsibility for what he's done and stop destroying me and my name. He broke my heart. My heart is completely broken. Mel never understood what went wrong in the relationship. He regrets that he couldn't read women's thoughts, like in one of his movies. The truth is that I don't really know what women want. No woman even wanted to speak to Mel. He could only dream about a long-lasting relationship. Just three years later, he had a new relationship with Rosalind Ross. And pretty soon, they had a baby. That is Mel's ninth child. It's five weeks. Yeah. And look at her. She looks fantastic. So She's amazing. Saying. I'm the only one with stretch marks. But everyone still remembered the story of Mel and Oksana. Fans were afraid that it would happen again. But Mel managed to get rid of his Mad Max. He finally has a good relationship with his first wife. We're both in on this, you know. Um, Despite the, the fact that we're separated, we're both still on this, so that's, that's good. Which is, which is a nice bond to have besides yeah. your children. Cool, you absolutely, know? yeah. And Oksana was able to forgive him, too. I don't hate him. I, I feel sorry for him. Mel understood that he had made mistakes in the past. But he drew the right conclusions and found happiness. And even he uses that gut-ripping experience in his work. 
oh my God, any, any experience you have in life enriches your work somehow, mm. good or bad, I mm. think. Do you think Mel will ever go crazy again?